Hey guys, it's free sec. Free, free tech support. <laughs> no, free tech support, as you can see on my background. It's Vince here, as you can see right here. And today I'm going to bring you a tutorial for Yuli Video Studio SE DVD. Um, make sure, or this is for recording in widescreen. Okay, so listen carefully, because I might go pretty fast, because that's a habit. Okay, make sure that this box right here is unchecked. Never check this. You don't need it. Now click Movie Wizard for recording. It's going to make your theme change to Windows Vista Basic. Click Capture. Let it load. This always takes forever. I hate it. Okay, okay. Okay, the format, want to make it MPEG, M-P-E-G, or MPEG for short. It could also be called MPG, but on this, it's MPEG. Now click Options, Video and Audio Capture Property Settings. Where it says the Input Source, change that to, um, if you use S-Video, if you use the S-Video cable, select S-Video. If you use Composite, which I do, switch it to Composite. Okay. Um. Now you go to Capture. Don't need to mess with Channel or Color. Make sure it's set to um, Customize. And in Frame Size, change it to 720 by 480 now the quality change that to 100 percent and then click advanced the templates click dvd or under the templates menu yeah i had fun today i'm in the middle of making a video okay yeah sorry for that interruption um for the template just click this just click dvd ntsc 720 by 480 and then where it says right here, down here in aspect ratio, put display, or click the drop down menu, 2 colon, display aspect ratio, 16 by 9, and click that, and it'll change it, click OK, and OK. This will update it, um, it shouldn't be a very long update, yeah. And then, if you want to mess around with this, just make sure it says, Forced to use preview mode. Um, capture audio. Capture the library. I don't like that because it puts it down there. And then if you delete the clip, it will say um, skip, relink, or cancel. I don't like that because you can click skip. And the next, if you deselect the menu and then reselect it, it will say skip, relink, cancel again. So just make sure that capture to library is off. And click OK. That doesn't take near as long. And you'll see up here that your format has changed to DVD. That's fine. It's supposed to do that. So, um, I guess this is the finished product of me playing Gears of War 2 widescreen with a square screen TV. So, here it is. Roll the clip.